Well, good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 23. By this point, you would have already seen what I did this morning. My mom and I had a tour at 10.30 for the Stetson Mansion, which is located very close to Stetson University, which is in DeLand, which is where my parents live. My mom hadn't ever gone there before, so we went there. Unfortunately, you couldn't take any video or photos inside of the home. It is a personal residence, so the two owners actually are there year round, even though they open up their home all the time for people, which is fantastic. I will tell you it was beautiful and gorgeous and opulent and just amazing. So if you're ever in this area, I would highly recommend going. As you saw, we were able to take photos of the grounds, so I did some of that for you so you could kind of see. Today, again, my brother is missing in action. He went to go visit a friend that was gonna be in the St. Augustine area today, which is about an hour and a half away from where my parents are. So he went and did that, so it is just myself my mom and my dad. I am currently sitting in my dad's truck, which by the way is like horrible, horrible to drive. It's some Honda thing. I don't understand it. It just, it's so tight and my dad complains about this vehicle all the time. I don't know why he just doesn't get a new vehicle. Like he bought this brand new when he moved down here. He's complained about it ever since. I don't understand. Like just get a little like SUV or something. I don't know. I don't know what the car is. Maybe I'll write it in the like description. I don't know, but I hate driving this thing. It is the worst. My mom doesn't even want to drive it, which is why I'm in the driver's seat. So anyway, um, we just got home and we are waiting for my dad to get ready and we are going to go grab some lunch. So maybe I'll show you a little bit of that because I don't think we're doing anything fun tonight. Um, my brother thinks that he's not going to be back for dinner time, so I don't think we're planning on doing anything extravagant or what, not that we do like extravagant things, but you know, like go out anywhere. Um, we might go out somewhere, but it's not going to be like a big to do kind of a thing. So anyway, I think when I get back from lunch, I am going to work a little bit. I may actually film today too. I'm rocking my YouTube shirt, so maybe I'll do some filming today. I need to film a couple of videos while I'm here. Plus I need to do my brother video, but I think, oh, my arm's getting tired. Um, hold on, let's go there. Oh, switching shots. Um, I think I am going to end up filming with my brother tomorrow, which is Christmas Eve. So I think that is going to happen. Anyway, we are headed off to a village cafe and my mom is here now. Oh, there's my mom. Hello. Hello, are you excited for Village Cafe? Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Is Dad ready now? He's got his pants on, so that's a good thing. Dad's got his pants on. That means there's serious things are happening, a.k.a. the Village Cafe. This is, like, one of the only places he doesn't complain about eating at. I'll see you there. Today, I'm going for some tomato soup action, as well as a sandwich, which you will see in just a moment. And for the main course, I went with the grilled ham and cheese on the like the little panini press and they give you chips here which is kind of nice so I'm excited about this so we are baking now um change of plans I did not actually film I did a little tiny bit of work but I took a nap hence makeup free Emily but let me show you what we did da -da -da! we made these little guys with the almond bark and put all the sprinkles on. Look, those are the sprinkles I did. My mom told me I was stingy with the sprinkles, so I got a little excited. And then we've got some holiday colors ones. Pretty. Okay, and we are also making the rum cake from Carlos, and let's see how that is doing. Oh yeah, that's looking tasty. Yum. So there are two parts to this recipe. The cake is one part and then there's like a glaze. So um, I think my mom is getting ready to make the glaze. So I will show you the final product when it's done. So my mom is deep in the throes of making that topping like I just said. However, I figured I would show you what we got at the Stenson, Stenson? Stetson Mansion. Wow. Um, got a couple of things. I had my eye on this bad boy and my mom was very nice to get it for me. Happy Christmas, I got an empty lunch liquor bottle. I gotta do something about that, you know? No um, but it is the John B. Stetson bourbon whiskey, and I'm actually a really big whiskey fan. Random fact. But yeah, I thought this was really cool. We actually saw a whole bunch of these in one of the roomscapes. It was really, really pretty. And then my mom actually got this 
it is like a Christmas collection booklet of some of their interior shots. Unfortunately, they didn't allow us, um, like I said before, to actually take photos inside of the mansion. So I'll show you a couple of these. Um, actually, none of their rooms were decorated in this fashion any longer, but it sounds like one of the owners, was it JT? Was that his name? JT Thompson. JT Thompson, okay. He is the mastermind behind this and we actually got to meet him which was like completely fabulous. He was amazing. But he creates all of this stuff just from thin air. It's amazing. He does reuse um, things from time to time but he makes new themes in all of his rooms every single year which is like so crazy. But anyway, let me show you. Oh, and my mom actually just brought this over. This is a ornament for the Christmas tree, which was like this pretty wood. And then also, it's a magnet. Huh. It's like double duty, you know? Anyway, which I thought that was really cool. All right, so let me show you some of the booklet. All right, so here is the booklet. There is just some really pretty things. Um, I mean, if sorry the glare, you guys, but I mean, if you think this is pretty, you need to go there in person because it is just glorious. Um, I will leave the website of this Stetson Mansion down below. So if you guys are ever in the DeLand area or even in Orlando, it's not that far of a drive. Um, also, if you're in Daytona Beach, it's kind of right in the middle as well. My brother's texting me. P.S. My brother's not home. I don't know what the heck's going on with him, but whatever. He'll never watch this vlog anyway, right, Phil? Right. Well, and they do have tours from February to April that are not holiday themed, but yeah. they're glorious as well. Yeah, we're kind of interested to see it like Certain without the holiday theme, but I mean, it was so cool to see them with the holidays. So um, we actually had this little BOGO thing where if you went today, um, they stamped your pass. So like my mom can go back again with another paying person and then see it in a different time so one, one yeah person. it's really cool so I think she'll probably end up going back um, during like non holiday time which is really cool anyway but, but it's a beautiful beautiful property yeah I mean that you guys saw the outside because I did take footage of the outside but yeah the inside we couldn't take it it is a private residence and they do live there year-round so this is just the coolest thing it's so cool you guys but anyway i just wanted to share that and i need to get back to my texting with my brother to tell him to come home so phil come home spend time with your family that's why you're here all right so these are all done we have made a few just a few just a few <laughs> there's another one as well that's completely full um all right so the rum cake is done here's the topping like this glaze thing but my favorite part Get to take a skewer or whatever we are gonna go with a chopstick because that's how we roll here poke holes in cake with ice pick pour glaze over cake while still in pan completely cool cake before removing from pan boop, boop. all right well we don't have an ice pick but we're gonna go with this but you just you just strategically put holes wherever you would like and that is gonna help get this cake all nice and drunk <laughs> Getting drunk, cake is drunk, yeah. And there's actually um, some crushed walnuts on the top of it as well, which I'll show you when we take it out. Because none of our family members are nut free um, that will be attending this. All right, I think That's we enough. are good. All right, so mom's gonna pour it. All right, let's see how this works. We'll see. Oh yeah, giggity goo. Look at all the goodness. And it's amazing, it just like soaks it up. And this is rum and butter and sugar and something else. Yeah, actually what I'll do is I will type in the description box the recipe if you guys wanna test it out for yourselves because this is like delicious. And then if you do test it out, like tag me on Instagram or something um, because it's so good, you oh, guys. Oh, water is the other item. So, oh, and water, okay. But I'll type out the recipe in the description box if you guys wanna check it out. All right, I will show you this when it's all done cooling. All right, mother is going to attempt to turn over the cake. We're gonna see what happens. The pan is still a little bit warm, but the cake is totally cool to the touch now on the on like the underside. Oh. <gasps> oh, look how beautiful. Nice. Oh, that looks nice. See, and like I said, we put um, some crushed 
walnuts on the top. So, got some nuts. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That looks delicious. It smells really good. I think it smells better than Carlos's because it has the nuts on it, but that's just me. Let me see. It smells nutty. All right, well, I'm gonna end the vlog here. It is 11 p.m. and I am going to upload my footage and I say I wanna edit right now, but I don't think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna go to bed because I'm tired. Tomorrow there are fun things in store because it is Christmas Eve. So you will be seeing, whoa, you will be seeing um, probably some other family members and things. I don't know if I'm actually going to talk to them or you're just gonna see like pans of faces. I don't really know what's gonna happen tomorrow, but we are gonna go to Ormond Beach tomorrow. Um, I think my mom's gonna go do some shopping. Not sure if I'm gonna go or not, but we'll uh, decide later. And then I'm actually gonna film tomorrow. That's like my Christmas Eve plans is I'm actually going to do some filming, so. That'll take me a little while to get that done, but I just need to do it in the daylight. Like I said, I was gonna try to do it today, but just wasn't feeling it, yo. Just wasn't feeling it. And you will actually see at least one of those videos next week, right? Yes, next week. I'm so confused because I'm like a day behind and you know, life. So anyway, I uh, hope you guys are having a good day and enjoying Vlogmas. Make sure to thumbs up the video if you liked it and make sure to subscribe. Um, normal videos are Monday, Wednesday, Friday and then Vlogmas is going on until the 31st but there will be a video until January 1 for you guys during Vlogmas. So anyway, hope you're having a good day and I will talk to you all later. Bye!